Cat. This video is another St. Patrick's Day themed video and in this one I'll show you how to make this adorable St. Patty's Day friendship bracelet. I really had a lot of fun making this one and I hope you guys do as well. If you want to see more tutorials like this one let me know in the comments below. If you're not already subscribed please hit that subscribe button. Hit the notification bell next to it so you get updates when I post new videos. Follow me on social media at Katrinaocity. Check out my podcast at mdxpods.com and if you enjoyed this video please click the like button. It really helps my videos get seen. All right, this is the pattern I'm using. It is pattern 5454 on friendshipbracelets.net and it has quite a few strings, but the pattern itself is fairly straightforward. So I'm going to cut all of my strings and get started. Okay, so this pattern, you can see all the strings at the top of them and there are seven white strings and seven green strings. So what I've done is I have cut six green strings and six white strings to 60 inches and then I've cut one white string to half that length and one green string to half that length. So now I'm gonna take my longer strings that I have cut and I'm gonna grab the ends of them. Those are all the ends. Holding them together, I'll make a loop and find the center of all of them. And then I'll take my short strings and add that to that bunch with the loop and tie an overhand knot. Now I'm gonna trim off some of that excess string there that's in those short ones. I have seven green strings and seven white strings. So I'm gonna clip that up in my clipboard and arrange them to start the pattern. So for this first row, it starts with one forward knot and then the rest are all forward backward. For the second row, I'm going to do one forward and then the rest backward forward. But since this is a one-two pattern, my end strings on this second row are going to come out and then I'm going to pair off all the remaining strings. For the third row, the outer strings are coming back in, and I'm starting with one backward forward. Five forward. and one forward backward. For the fourth row, the outer strings are coming back out. Pair everything off.
Start with two forward backward. Two backward forward. One forward backward. And one backward forward. For the fifth row, outer strings come back in. Pair everything off. Start with two backward forward. Three forward backward. One backward forward. And one forward. For the sixth row, those outer strings come back out and pair everything off. Start with two forward backward. One backward forward. One backward. And two forward backward. For the seventh row, those outer strings come back in, pair everything off. Start with one backward. One forward. One backward. Two backward forward. One forward backward. And one backward forward. For the eighth row, outer strings come back out, pair everything off. Start with four forward.
and two backward forward. Ninth row outer strings come back in, pair everything off. Start with one backward forward. One forward backward. One backward. Two forward. One forward backward. And one backward forward. Tenth row outer strings come back out, pair everything off. Start with two backward forward. One forward. Forward backward. And two backward forward. Eleventh row outer strings come back in, pair everything off, and begin with one backward forward. One forward. One backward. Two forward. One forward backward. And one backward forward. Twelfth row outer strings come back out. Start with one forward. Three backward forward. And two forward backward. Thirteenth row outer strings come back in, pair everything off.
Begin with one forward backward. One forward. One backward. One backward forward. One forward. And two backward. Fourteenth row, those outer strings come back out once again and pair everything off. Start with two forward. One backward, one forward backward, and two backward forward. For the 15th row, those outer strings come back in, pair everything off. And this whole row is forward backward. Sixteenth row is all backward forward. And those outer strings are coming back out. For the 17th row, those outer strings come back in, pair everything off, and this entire row is forward backward. And for the 18th and final row, those outer strings come back out, pair everything off, and do the whole row in backward forward.
And that is the entire pattern. So now your strings are back in their original starting positions, alternating white and green, white and green, white and green, all the way across. And so you're ready to start back over at the very beginning of the pattern. And just repeat this as many times as you need until your bracelet is as long as you want it.